my parents, we'd always go to thrift stores and antique stores, and that's kind of, we'd get secondhand things, so I just kind of grew up with it. The pieces that I use um, have stories and patina and authenticity that they um, bring to a space, so that's, that's kind of what I love. It's a little small. <laughs> we made it work today. Um, we're actually hoping to get a sprinter van. Super excited to be a part of this window display um, for the August window at Sparkle Bridal. And we went with a little bit of a bohemian wanderlust theme. I um, wanted to bring in some natural elements, some sparkle elements, and um, some of my style that is very eclectic. Goes a little bit from kind of the countryside, European countryside, all the way to um, woodland bohemian. The colors that I was going for, I wanted a little bit of color highlighted, but not too much. I wanted to stay kind of fairly neutral. Um, I brought in some pops of kind of violet and purples and blues um, and then on the other end some bright greens for summer so some palms and um, gold highlights. has this kind of like romantic traveler boho wanderlust kind of feel to it and considering it's August the last month of summer it's still a chance to get out there and do something so we wanted to kind of pair up our dresses that have that same feel and something relaxed and fun and a little bit boho so we wanted to go ahead and kind of show off some of these gowns our first one here to my left is a kind of a heavier tool netting uh, that we have here for fabric, but this little lace detail at the waistline really helps to kind of cinch the waist in and create a nice hourglass, even though there's a really great drape to it. Now here we have something just a little bit more structured. This sweetheart neckline sparkle gown has a little a touch of this uh, kind of little belting through here that has a little bit of sparkle to it, so it still adds a little glam to kind of that wonderlust feel. For our third dress we have in the window this month, we have another tulle gown, but it has just a little touch of glam with little detail through here. So we'll have keeping that boho effect, but just a little bit of sparkle and pearl at the waistline. And for our final gown, we definitely amp up the glam part of boho and kind of uh, wonderless chic. With the fully beaded top, little nice empire waistline, and again that drape of tulle. It's keeping everything really light, really soft, and very flowy. Debbie from I Do's by Deb made a gorgeous cake with a geode coming out of it, which is super cool, which will tie into the boho theme. I never quite know what um, is actually going to come together in the end. What I have planned in my head and I go over it and over it and over it um, comes out, usually ends up being better than what I even expected. And this one, I think, same thing. I love it. Awesome, baby. Thank you. Yeah, I'm gonna love it. So. Yeah.